This is an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar taking a look at the Essential Sound Panel on Adobe Audition CC. Hi, this is Larry Jordan. In this excerpt, I'll show you how to transfer files from Premiere or Final Cut into Adobe Audition and how to get them back. This is the mini doc we're going to use for today's example. It runs about 50 seconds. It features Dr. Vint Cerf talking about the interplanetary internet. It's got talking head, sound effects, and music. Everything is in the right spot. Our supers are fine, the color is fine, the shots are fine, and the mix is a catastrophe. Our talking head audio is too low, our music is too loud, we can't hear the effects, and the deadline is staring us in the face. We're going to send this over to Audition by selecting a project, go up to Edit, Edit an Adobe Audition, and say Sequence. We're going to give this a name, Dr. Surf Doc, and save it. First question I have is from Yuri, who's asking whether he can send a project or timeline from Final Cut 10 to Adobe Audition to be able to fix the audio or do a mix, and the answer is yes. What you do is inside Final Cut 10, you do an export of an XML file. Export of an XML file. Then, from the Mac App Store, you get a utility called X to CC. This converts a Final Cut 10 XML file to something that can be read by Premiere or After Effects, Audition, Final Cut 7. You run this conversion utility, which is almost instantaneous. You just drop the file on, it gets it converted. Then you import that XML file into Audition using File import and it's just bring it in as a file. It's going to come in automatically. It's going to recognize it as an XML file. If this is the project, to get it back to Premiere, go to Multitrack, export to Adobe Premiere Pro. What this does is it opens up a dialog saying, what are you going to call it? Do you want to export each track as a stem, which I almost never do? Do you want to expect export each bus as a stem? Remember, we've talked buses in other training where I group multiple tracks to have a dialog bus, an effects bus, and a music bus. Then I'll also have a mixed down session, and I can create at the same time a mono of my entire file, a stereo of my entire file, or buses of the, of the whole thing. Then it just automatically opens Premiere Pro, says, what track do you want me to put this on, and it puts it there. It's very clean. For everything except Premiere, go to Export, Multitrack, Mix Down, Entire Session. For Premiere, go to Multitrack, uh, Export to Adobe Premiere Pro. This has been an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar taking a look at the essential sound panel inside Adobe Audition. For the complete version of this online training, please visit our store at LarryJordan.com slash store and look for Webinar 200. By the way, membership is a great value when you need to stretch your training dollars. A subscription membership to our video training library saves you money. You can access all of our videos for a low monthly price of only $19.99. That's more than 1,400 movies, hundreds of hours, all in-depth and all up-to-date. Plus, members can attend any of our Power Up webinars for free. Our training covers Apple and Adobe software. We update it every week. And for more information, visit LarryJordan.com slash membership.